So this is Cave Sim, the electronic cave simulator. It is built into a trailer and has about 50 to 60 foot of linear passage on the inside. And there are a whole bunch of formations and other obstacles on the inside which you're trying to avoid. Um, here we can see the interface that, that uh, the volunteers get to watch and everybody else gets to watch as you run through it, uh, showing different angles and all the different things to avoid. Uh, we've got gypsum flowers, stalactites, stalagmites, um, some dripping water, a lizard, and a cave painting. So um, come on out and do your best, see if you can avoid hitting anything, and see how good of a time you can get. Um, I'm going to give it a go, and I'm going to start back here. And i got to turn my light on. Here goes. I'm going to come in here started. Have fun. to text that I've started in. I'm trying to avoid hitting anything too important. Oh, it's good to be a responsible caver. And if I were really in a really, really in a cave this tight, I might just turn back and decide it wasn't worth it. Because I'm getting awfully co close to these. A little bit of a climb up here. Oh, ow. <laughs> Some nice columns here. Looks like we have some muddy footprints and a cave painting that I'm going to do my darndest not to touch. Some archaeologists might be unhappy at me. I'm going to go down here. Oh man, and we've got really cool looking cave bacon, which is right where I want to go. So I'm going to go around here to the left and under it and I also have to watch out for this guy which is right in the way uh, uh. I told you I'd make funny noises while recording this ow okay and over here we have a dripping rimstone pool it looks like and a some pottery and look a salamander. Um, there are two branches in here. Uh, we can go the harder way or the easier way. And I never want to go the easier way. Oh. So you just heard a beep. That means I hit something. Oh no, I see what happened. I think I may have bumped the salamander. I'm not sure. Oh. Well, we'll find out when I get back out there. Oh. So I'm going to come up here, and now I've got the problem that I need to go up and over this. And there's these nice gypsum flowers there. So I've got to stay way away from those. I didn't say this would be pretty video. Okay. So there's the gypsum, and I'm going to go up and over the saddle, but man, there's formations all in the ceiling. Okay, trying to go over the formations. Okay. Whew. That worked. And I've got to avoid that. And it looks like there's a bat up in the corner, but if I shine my light on him too much, he might notice. And I don't want to bother the bat. I'm trying really hard to avoid that formation. Then we come to another split. Looks like there's an atria here. I'm going to go ahead and go up it. And it looks like, oh man, there's a bunch more formations. I've got to go up and over that. Luckily there are all these climbing holds. So I can get this way. Let's see if I can avoid hitting that. Yeah. Okay. And then down here. And there's daylight. I'm trying to hit anything on the way out. No promises. Uh, uh. 
So what was my time? Uh, three minutes, fifty-six seconds with six damages, but they were all in a place where you weren't. So I lowered the uh. sensitivity. Okay. Yes. Cool. Well, there we go. That was Cave Sam.